Hello and welcome Aquarius. Welcome to Thomas's Tower Readings. You are watching Thomas's Tower Readings with myself, Thomas Janak. Please like, subscribe and share. And if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Now, Aquarians, what we will do here, we will look at the overall energy for the months of February for your very sign. And then we will look at your emotional core, see if there's love coming in or maybe, you know, pain that can go, healing that can, has to happen or needs to happen, that sort of stuff. Before you finally look at your opportunities, which means, you know, what sustains you financially, see if there's, you know, any changes coming that could benefit you and what to actually look out for. So, um, when you're ready, let's just dive right in. So, with regards to the overall energy, you have the energy of expanding expansion Sagittarius so the, the, the depiction is that Sagittarius is obviously the archer and therefore it means that when you have a bow and arrow you have to decide how much oomph do I actually give that arrow when I shoot the arrow so the point they're making is your job so the over energy for you is to whatever you do expand it expand on what it is you're doing. So what I'm getting for you in, in February 2023 is not necessarily to think about abandonment. Uh, that doesn't mean you can't make changes, but it is much more sensible in February 2023 for the sign of Aquarius, which is the water bearer. You are the person that is there just to give in many ways, which doesn't always um, help. And you have to sometimes even override your own imprint. The point this month is, is to actually keep giving while at the same time understanding that you only give when people deserve it sounds a bit weird but you understand that you know people have to treat yourself a certain way for you to freely give so yes i do see here some boundaries but the point they're making is you know be your generous self and um, see where things are going from there in the month of february 2023 and what i'm getting above everything here and above all else is this may not be the months to leave the job you don't like. This may not be the months um, to remove yourself from a relationship that doesn't work. Now remember, you have free will. Don't shoot the messenger. If it's not working, by all means, don't listen to me. <laughs> but you understand that the overall energy here is about expansion, which means look at it. What can be done about this to make this wider so maybe it can be improved okay that is your overall energy for the month of february 2023 for the sign of aquarius and now we're looking at your emotional core and you have libra which is balance so when it comes to your love life because i'm not getting healing i'm just getting your love life find a balance are you a person that is in a situation that you have a partner that is going through stuff um, and you feel I really have to be there 24 7 he or she needs me and you can see I'm mocking you slightly because it is a it is bollocks right you you only give how much you can give and make sure that the other party understands that when you're there and you're willing to help does not entitle them to to bother you with everything they have um, at any time of day or night so understand that please when it comes to your love life look for balance right where am i in the scheme of things and do i get as much out of it out, out of it than i give right it's about reflecting okay that is your uh, emotional core for the month of february 2023 for the sign of aquarius now lastly let's look at opportunities as they present themselves to you in the months of february 2023 for your very sign and it is interesting because whether or not you make changes whether or not new opportunities can reach you you have to clarify what it is you really want so solar calm is a bit of a of an interesting term because one of the the planets that has the lot the most of activity is actually the sun there's always a, a ton of stuff happening on the sun and solar calm means that every now and then the sun is really in alignment with itself right and so what they're saying to you is find that inner strength from 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 which you then 
assess where you want to go but you have clarifying here right so clarify you know before you go for new positions check if this is really what you want to do right clarify with whoever makes you an offer what the offer actually entails and what it doesn't so the point is if someone says to you like oh yeah you know um we're doing this and then we're doing this and then we're doing this and then we give you all that stuff where the fuck is it <laughs> right um so you understand that so the point they're making is here is with, with, with clarify um i think what i'm getting here as well is is, is or, or, or mostly is you know expect from any other party that you you do correspond with when it comes to making changes to your your work life for the most part um is to be absolutely uh, transparent and honest that's all you really want right and there's another really important thing because aquarians by default you are very honest sometimes even too honest brutally honest um which always you probably know this is already being aquarius um doesn't always serve you but the point is if you expect that same transparency from others um, things are much easier not to be misunderstood okay Aquarians thank you so much for watching that's all we got time for please like subscribe and share because it does help the um, channel grow and hey if you have any comments why don't you leave them in the in the in the description box uh, or in the comment section below it would be lovely to hear from you thank you so much see you next month bye bye